Hello everyone, it's Yuri here, and today I decided to do a little video on just a Style Korean haul. Um, I mostly buy most of my K-beauty stuff from Style Korean, so I was kind of bored and I'm like, I need to like work on posting more YouTube videos on this channel. So I'm like, you know what, let's do a Style Korean haul. So, came in today, I was at work, so... My mom put in my room for me, and I really did not get that much. I usually order a lot more than this, but you know, they always have like one size of a box on Style Korean, and they just put a lot of bubble wrap. Um, yeah, but I really didn't, it's not gonna be anything big, and this is not super heavy because I actually mostly just got makeup items. If I get like skincare, this box is like super cool, you know? But because this is mostly. Oops. Okay. Because this is mostly makeup, there's really not that much stuff. But I still thought it would be fun to just show you what I bought and some stuff I'm gonna be trying off camera. Here's my receipt. Oh my god. You guys can't see anything on that side. Okay, let's just show you. Let me show you what I bought. I hope you guys didn't see anything. Yeah. Probably just saw lines. Wrapping to the ground. Yeah, like, see, this box is only filled like half. <laughs> but they, I guess it's style Korean, they only have like one size of box, so. First, I see a free gift they gave this time was a little Kos RX moisturizing lotion, oil-free ultra moisturizing lotion with birch sap. I was actually going to place another style Korean like last night and something I always do is I like go check out and see what the free gift is because they're not always, sh they used to actually uh, show it on the website like oh if you spend 120 bucks you get this free gift right but now it's like mystery so i go to check out and see what the free gift was and it was like a full size tokobo the lemon aha bha toner and i'm like i've been wanting to try that the sunscreens got really popular like this tokobo blue is like a baby blue sun stick and the sun cream people are really loving those so i actually ordered one actually there should be a tokobo sunscreen in here if I am not mistaken, I did order that. Okay, so this was a new brand on Style Korean Day launch. It's Kirsch, Kirsch, Kirsch Blending. Kirsch, Kirsch Blending. And this was in the time deal around like $11.99. It is the oil control blur powder in white pink. Personally, I really, right now, I love using the Too Cool for School white powder, pressed white powder. It's really finely milled. And it really helps reduce the oils, even after applying foundation and stuff. It reduces all the shine really, really well. And I, used some, I hit pan on it. So, I bought a refill. I bought a second one. But I saw this on sale, and I thought, maybe, we, maybe we'll maybe we give another brand a try. I did try the Pear Pear one before. It kind of it was kind of gritty. It wasn't as finely milled. As a two cool for school, no, no judge on pear pear though. Okay. Ooh, so much stuff. Okay, so I bought one of these before, and I gave it to my aunt to try. This is the pear pear ink thin thin brush liner, and this is another Kirsch blending product. This is the Cool Wear Brow Shaper from Kirsch Blending. Kirshi, Kirshi. Kurushi, Kurushi, Kurushi blending. If you say it in English, you just want to say Kirsch, but in Korean it's Kirsch. Um, they actually have colors of this one. I just got the clear. I typically just use clear brow gel and then fill in my brows with a brow pencil. Okay, this is something I've been eyeballing for the longest time. This is the Pear Pear Ink Ink Airy Tint. I really love these. I have like two or three shades of them already. And this shade is one of their renewal shades, so a new shade they came out with. It's really pretty. I, um, this is another one of the Pear Pear Ink 
airy velvet. This one was 19. This is like the elf rose shade. Yeah, elf light rose. This color is really pretty and it kind of matches my natural lip color. So it's like an MLBB for me. And this one is the shade 21. This is our new, you can see the packaging is different, right? And this is their new peach line. Next product, I was already talking about this, the Tokabo. The Tokabo Cotton Soft Sunstick. SPF 50 PA Quadruple, SPF 50 Plus PA Quadruple Plus. One of the like highest SPFs you can get. So this one and the actual like cream sunscreen they have in this line is really popular right now in Style Korean. And the next product I have is the Jumiso Jumiso yeah, Jumiso All Day Vitamin Brightening and Balancing Facial Serum I've been really also eyeballing this one on Style Korean a lot this one's actually for their new Ready Set Glow review um, giveaway so this is something I will be filming a video on soon I have to post a review within 10 days of today this is, you actually get three products to choose from for the Ready, Set, Glow review challenge. So there's the first one was the Jimmy Cell. The second one is Dr. Dr. Shuraku. Dr. Shuraku. Dr. Shuraku Tea Tree Purifying Green Up Sun. Tone Correcting, Calming, and UV Protection. SBF 50+, plus, PA Quadruple. Plus, still the highest amount of protection you can get from a sunscreen. But soon after I post this, I will have to do a video on these. So stay tuned for that. Ooh, okay. Oh, this was the last product for the Ready Set Glow review challenge. So the last product I also have to write a review for is the Amuse Dew Velvet. In the shade jazz i'm actually not a huge fan of this color but this is the only color they had i wish you could have picked a color but i guess we're kind of just trying it in this case i'm really trying for the formulation not for the color because i don't wear a lot of like bright red lip tints um speaking of lip tints another li another lip tint i bought or actually this is actually a stick the moon matte Ink Mood Matte Stick from Peripera. This one is also really popular. And he, and I always see her like, oh, Cho, Hyo Jin, Cho Hyo Jin's pick on Olive Young Global. So she loves this one. one of, I think she did come out with a shade though. Or one of her favorite shades from the line. I ordered a lot of lip. I already warned y'all. I bought a lot of makeup this time. I usually just buy more skincare on style korean but they had a lot of makeup sales going on so this was another time deal Ro romand zero velvet tint and this is the shade grain nude these these tints from romand are really popular so i finally decided to buy one okay what else do i have here oh these ones was a last minute add to cart I've seen these sun patches get so popular lately, so this one has been on sale at Hamish brand. So I decided to buy one, and I've been like doing a lot of art outdoor activities lately. Like I was at my aunt's house, me and my cousin go bike riding, and we go walking, um, go to the park and stuff. So I was watching a video by Sue, and she really likes the AHC ones, but they don't have those AHC ones on style cream yet, so... I decided to try these. They're not as big as the AHC ones, but they're watermelon, which is interesting. Um, this is a nail, actually. This is not makeup. Um, I really like, lately I, I do my own nails because I have a really weird nail shape and I can't, I can only buy certain type of nail products. And um, this one, this one was on clearance on Style Korean. And I like black, so yeah, I actually have another color by them. I haven't tried it, but they're really good quality. The reviews are really good, and the only problem is if you don't have the gel lamp, you can't use them because you have to cure them. So that's the only flaw about it. 
Oh my god, this is heavier than I expected. Give me a minute. Oh, it's so crushed. It's sad. Okay, in the picture, it did not look crushed. It was solid. Like, solid pieces of scorched rice. But no. I actually grabbed a couple snacks. This is a new snack they had on Style Korean. So a new launch where they had um, a time deal for this too. This is scorched rice. My grandma makes this and eats it. My harmony eats this all the time. She just makes it homemade. This is actually made with chapsa, so sweet rice. It's all crushed. Like, why did they put it at the bottom? I mean, I guess it's heavy, but like, now it's all crushed. So I'm so sad. It's not supposed to be crushed. It's supposed to be kind of like pieces. Anyways, I'm moving on. There's a couple of things left here. Okay. So the last couple things here is another snack. <laughs> I've got the Portoro Yakuas, which if you don't know what Yakuas are, it's like a little traditional like cookie made with honey. So it's, it's very different from typical standard like chocolate chip cookie, you know? But these are one of my childhood favorites, so I like these. And I bought these because BTS used them. <laughs> if you already can't tell, ARMY over here, my BTS posters are on the wall. But, um, Style Korean started selling these because it was in BTS in the soup and J-Hope was using it. And I was like, okay, I need to spend a little bit more, let's just try this. It was on sale too, time deal. Around $6.99, you get only three masks. I do think they're a little pricey, but it's not a typical sheet mask, it's actually made with mud. I don't use enough, I don't use a lot of mud and clay mask anymore. I typically just opt for the sheet mask. Because like, clay mask, the ones that like dry out and do help with sebum, like, they're hard to wash off and it feels a little harsh on my skin. So that's why I just go for sheet mask, but I was like, you know, this one is like a sheet mask, but it's with mud and not like the typical like serum, so. And I need some calm in my life. You can't really see it on camera, but my skin be not happy with me right now. So hopefully I like this. Not something I usually use. And the last thing was actually a free gift. And it is a Tokobo mini towel. This is so cute. This, this is so cute. You know, I wash my face every night. This is exactly what I need. A little mini towel to dry my face with after. And it is the same brand as this. I really like the color and the design. It's like the square print. I'm pretty. I wonder how big it is. I don't want to open it right now. I kind of want to keep it sealed for now. But it'd probably be like that big. Big enough for my big face. <laughs> LOL. Um, that is it. This video is already too long for a style cream haul. But I will definitely probably do a makeup video soon. And maybe try some of these new products I bought. And a video will be coming for these products. Because I have to try these right away when I get them. So I'm looking forward to those. Um, anyways, that is all. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, leave a comment. Stay tuned for the next video. Ring the bell if you haven't. And... Yeah, thank you for watching and you have a great day. Bye-bye.